everyone, this is Naishal here for Solid Tech. In this quick blog video, I'm going to be talking about the SolidWorks Background Downloader. Uh, we'll talk about what it is and how we can turn it on or off. Um, now, the SolidWorks Background Downloader is a small Windows process that resides in our taskbar here. Uh, for me, it's this one right here. And uh, we can right-click and get some additional options out of this. Um, now, the SOLIDWORKS Background Download is a small utility that allows us to download um, service pack updates for SOLIDWORKS. Um, some people choose to uh, let the background download notify them of updates when it's available. And uh, some people simply choose to uh, not only to notify but also to download the uh, updates and then notify them uh, when it's available to be installed. Now, using some of these options here, we can cancel the uh, download. If it's in progress and you're using your system, you may wish to cancel it. Um, when the download is complete, we can uh, take a look at our installation options. In here, we can, we can um, start the installation of the update. And we can tell it to remind us a little bit later if you wish to uh, work on something else at the moment. And of course, we can uh, delete the download as well if you choose not to uh, update. Um, here we can change some of the download settings as well and uh, we can also uh, do a manual check for updates rather than uh, on a schedule. Um, if you're checking on a, on a certain uh, schedule then we're going to ch simply check this box to automatically check for updates. Um, we can also check this uh, to automatically download updates. Now when the updates are complete it will simply give you a bit of a notification in your taskbar area here and it'll uh, it will allow you to uh, choose whether you would like to install it or uh, wait for um, another time. Now this last option here is the ability to disable the background downloader. Um, some people wish to disable it because they wish to have control over when to download and when to install. So um, if you do wish to disable it, um, what you can do is you, you can simply select that box. Uh, some people will also go into their system, into their uh, control panel and then programs and features and they will actually take the utility right out of their system and you can do that simply by going into uh, your programs and features under control panel highlighting your SOLIDWORKS installation and then clicking change now when this loads um, you will be presented with a screen that looks similar to this screen capture here that I've got and in this screen, this screen capture is basically of the downloads options under the summary uh, page of the installation manager. And the option to install or uninstall the background downloader is right here. So the, uh, here's the checkbox, use the background downloader for future service packs. So we can simply uh, make our adjustments here, uh, click back to summary and then finish our installation and that will basically um, remove or install the background downloader as a Windows process. Thanks very much.